Welcome to day two of breaking Pokemon Scarlet, Violet and hoping Game Freak sometime might get around to patching it. Well today, we're going to show you how to duplicate unlimited numbers of your legendary Pokemon and items that it may be holding. Which means of course, infinite Master Balls, infinite XL experience candies, rare candies, anything that a Pokemon can hold. So this is a new glitch that involves riding Pokemon and just duplicating that riding Pokemon over and over again. Which of course, you can change its form into a battle form and I'm going to show you how to do all of this. It's beautiful, magnificent art. Let's have a look. So if you guys want infinite Master Balls, infinite Rare Candies, go into your game. And let's have a look at the setup here. So basically all you gotta do is you gotta change your riding Pokemon here into combat form. So you might, you will have to get to the end game or whatever that point is where you get that to be able to change form. So let's go ahead and hit A and we can change it into its battle form and we'll put it at the top of our party here. Okay, Toxel will be sent to the boxes. Next up, guys, we're going to give it an item to hold. So I'm going to duplicate some of my Master Balls here. So let's go over to my Master Balls. I'm going to duplicate these. I'll give it to a Pokemon to hold. I'm going to give it to my Legendary, as you can see up there. He's now holding the Master Ball. And now we're going to go start catching some Pokemon. All right, so this is where the magic happens. Let's go outside into the wild here. and Let's catch some Pokemon. But now that we're set up, it's a good idea always to just save, especially if you have autosave off. Save before and after the session. It's just my recommendation in this case. So once we find a Pokemon here in sight, there we go. I'll go ahead and save it here. Alright, let's just save our game here. Okay, so because I rode my Pokemon, uh, I have to get off again. <laughs> and I have to turn him into battle form again. So you actually have to do that, by the way. So make sure once you've sorted him out and given him his candy or given him his ball or given him whatever item you want to duplicate, go on to him again, ride form, and then put him back in your party again once he's holding the item. So as you can see, he's still holding the item there. And now we're ready to do this. So let's go ahead and catch these Pokemon. Bam! So this is going to involve a little bit of timing on your part, and it's pretty easy to get down, to be honest. I'll show you what I mean in a sec. And yes, that is a shiny Roaring Moon. Either way, we're going to go ahead and catch this Quick Ball here. Or sorry, catch this Bramblem here with my Quick Ball. Just easy. So far, relaxed. So far, no pressure. Okay, we caught him. Now, the next part, you want to be careful. We're going to hit A on the first option because we want to add it to our team. All right, so it's going to give me that option. Add to your party. Yes. Select a Pokemon. Yeah. And now we're going to go down and select our legendary. But this is the part where you have to be a little time wise here. You got to hit A and B almost at the same time. I'd recommend hitting A and then slipping your finger down to B in a sort of rhythm like A, B, A, B. All right. Only once or twice. Uh, if you're too slow, it won't work and you'll just get a chance to do it again like this. A, B, right? Too slow. Fine. But what about a little quicker? A, B. And then this will come up, right? So a little quick. AB, place the item in your bag, which means it's worked. Yes, we'll place the Master Ball in our bag. Croydon has a Master Ball, what would you like to do? Because of course we can't place our Ride Legendary in our bag, right? <laughs> so we're going to place the item in our bag and I'll show you what just happened. You place the Master Ball in your bag. Bramblin will be added to your party. And so the Pokemon you caught is added to my party. The Legendary that I was riding is now gone. We can hit plus again to just get him back. Simple as. And now that I'm riding my legendary, you'll be able to see my other legendary in my boxes. Voila. Uh, wrong box. Voila. There he is. That is a brand new legendary. The exact same as my, <laughs> my riding form legendary. However, we already put the master ball in my bag. So I'm going to do it again just to demonstrate for you folks. Let's go ahead and put him into battle form. And also, you don't have to give him another held item. He'll still be holding the item, by the way. Have a look. He's still holding the Master Ball, by the way. And as you'll be able to see my bags, I have a Master Ball right there. So let's do it again, and let's get two Master Balls in my box and another held one. Uh, there was another Bramlin around here. Where'd he go? All right, let's do this with Silicobra. Just go ahead and, like usual, like before, just go ahead and catch him. <laughs> it just takes up the whole screen. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go use a quick ball on him. Super exciting stuff, guys. Super exciting stuff. Absolutely love, absolutely love this stuff. It's so much fun. Okay, we caught our Silicobra. Add to your party. Once this all does, add to your party. 
Select a Pokemon, and then we're gonna go down to our Legendary, and we're gonna do AB. AB. Nope, too slow. AB. There we go. Koraiden has a Master Ball, what would you like to do? Place the item in your bag. <laughs> Easy as that, guys. Easy as that. And now, we have two Master Balls in our box. So, congratulations, everyone. You can now duplicate unlimited items, any item you want that a Pokemon can hold. When you're finished, go ahead and save your game just so you manage to keep it all, because as of yet, the game still does crash a little bit. If you have autosave, no harm done, no worries. Uh, it doesn't really make a difference, but if you don't have autosave, do not forget to save after your session so you don't lose all your progress. Now, I did try doing the Poke Portal and trading the spare Coridons that I have in my boxes, but sadly, it's still a special Pokemon. You cannot trade these Pokemon. But you will be able to get yourself a nice team of six. So some people might be wondering, how do you get rid of all the spare Coridons that you cannot really trade or use because for whatever reason the game interprets these as actually a single Pokemon which is interesting. So I'll show you right here. I put all of them in my party and they're the only Pokemon I have in my party. I cannot ride my Coridon. You'll have no Pokemon left to battle with if you do that. They all count as the same Pokemon. So go ahead into your bag. No, no. Go ahead, go ahead into your box <laughs> and add a Pokemon to your team. I'm going to go ahead and add my starter back just like this. I'm gonna go out of my thing, and I'm gonna hit plus to ride on my Pokemon. Bam. Then go ahead and hit A on your Coridon, just like this, and it will get rid of the spare Coridon. So that's how you erase them in your game. Very, very convenient, just to, so they're not sitting there taking up space. Otherwise, they will count as one Pokemon in a sense. You won't be able to ride or get off if they're in your team like that. Of course, you can use them in your team if you have multiple other members of your team. So just keep that in mind. Uh, either way, very, very cool. And now you can clean up your party as well. So I don't expect this to be patched for a long time. So enjoy it while it lasts. Very, very cool glitch that you'll be able to abuse and just get unlimited items. Something that everyone covets in a Pokemon game. And something that just happens to make its appearance in every Pokemon game as well. Why? Why are they so broke? Why are they so broken? Why do we do this to every single Pokemon game? Even if they're made by different companies, it doesn't even seem to make a difference. We're just able to do this every single time, which I am absolutely all for. And I hope you guys are too. Drop a sub if you want to see more, because we will be covering everything as it comes. And I'll see you around in the next video. Till then, guys. Bye!